Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tana with Boardroom to Bounce House. I make videos all about being a working mommy and life with two under two. Today I wanna share with you what I got my kids for Christmas. So this year I set a budget of $150 to spend on Black Friday. And here's the roundup of what I got for my two kids. I was trying to consciously buy small gifts this year that aren't going to take up a lot of space. So the first thing that I got is the Blue's Clues mailbox and handy dandy notebook. My toddler, who's about two and a half, has been totally into Blue's Clues lately, and I picked these up on sale. I also got him an Elmo letter set. He is totally all about singing the ABCs right now and learning all of his letters. So I got him this Elmo letter set that travels on the go. It looked like it was compact and pretty easy to store away. For my baby, who's nine months, I picked up this green toys car and we already have a couple of green toys products one of them that they love is the ferry boat and these cars are the exact same cars that are on the ferry boat they are always fighting over the cars if they're playing with the ferry boat in the bathtub so I thought I would pick up this toy so that we would have more of these cars I also got my baby a plush llama llama toy he's been really into llama llama red pajama lately and he really doesn't have too many stuffed animals of his own so I just thought that this was cute and I decided to get it for him all the rest of the gifts are going to be gifts that they can share and they're all from Melissa and Doug the first thing that I got them is the Melissa and Doug shopping cart I already have a lot of Melissa and Doug toys and I love Melissa and Doug and maybe it's a place where they could store all the food they already have and it would go kind of well with their food truck so I decided to get that for them. The next thing that I got them is the Melissa and Doug pots and pans. They don't really play with any pots and pans at our house because they don't have access to the kitchen. Uh, they do mainly play in our living room which is gated off and they do have the food groups toy from Melissa and Doug so I thought having these pots and pans would be pretty adorable. The next thing that I got them from Melissa and Doug is the Melissa and Doug canned goods and I specifically checked to make sure that these were plastic before I decided to purchase them. I do love the Melissa and Doug wood toys but they can be a little bit dangerous at times if I'm not right on the floor playing with my baby and my toddler because my toddler tends to throw things and the wood ones are pretty hard. So I liked that these cans were plastic. I did get them the Melissa and Doug sandwich kit and it's all felt so I thought this was another safe bet for the baby. The main reason that I decided to go with this one was because it's not wood. The last item that I got is the Melissa and Doug reusable stickers. I've heard amazing things about these stickers. I heard that they really do last quite a while and my toddler is really into stickers right now so I decided to get that. So that's everything I got for less than $150. Everything I purchased, I got at either Target or Amazon this year. I'll go ahead and link everything down below if you're interested in checking out any of these gifts. If you have any other great ideas, please leave them in the comments. I'd love to hear them. Thank you so much for watching. If you found these ideas helpful, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. And while you're at it, don't forget to hit subscribe. Coming up soon will be my stocking stuffer video, so make sure that you turn on your notifications. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.